He is out at first base. And for the first time in eight years, the Lancaster Barnstormers celebrate an Atlantic League title. Five to three, and they there you go with a big win tonight. The Lancaster Barnstormers will be crowned the Atlantic League champions. The Barnstormers back at home tonight, leading the series 2-0 against the High Point Rockers from North Carolina. Look at this guy behind me, Nick Volturo. I don't know. I mean, this is huge. But I see champagne. I see spitting champagne. I see cigars. What's happening? This is what you call a celebration, Jasmine. A championship celebration. Eight long years, obviously, waited to get to this moment to have that American championship banner hung. You can see how rowdy this group is. They got cigars lit. They're drinking beers. They're drinking champagne. Now, this is what championship looks like right here. Now, these are what an exciting group of champions look like right here. Take a look at this barn storm. Take a look at the t-shirts. This is a red storm in this locker room right now for this celebration. But while all eyes were locked on the field tonight, their hearts were in another place as a special ceremony took place right before the game. It's an emotional night for Jill Hardy and her family. We have had the best community support from day one when we got the news that Brandon was killed. Her son was killed in combat in Iraq in April of 2006. That's why I wore my shirt. I wear my Gold Star family pins every day. I've worn them every day since April 28, 2006. The family tonight joined by other Marines for the presentation of the American flag. He paid the ultimate sacrifice and she's here reminding everyone that it still happens all the time. It was a proud moment for Hardy as the red, white, and blue waved clutched tightly between her fingers. I had a flag draped coffin bring my son home. Um, so I'm probably one of the most honorable persons there is to the American flag. But after the ceremony, the focus shifting back to the diamond and the Barnstormers' quest for the third championship. Oh, it feels awesome. I was here for the first two. Now, hopefully they win tonight. And, and no slump in sight as the Stormers' bats on fire all night, jumping to an early... And I'm very sure that we're going to win today. And after eight years without a championship banner, the long wait is over as the Barnstormers sweep the series and bring home the American League title. I just can't wait till we get that final out. I'm counting down the strikes. And this is so wonderful. And I'm final out a long time away. Just check this celebration out. Eight years, guys. What does this mean to be here right now? To be able to clinch that title, a sweep in the series. Oh, it means a lot. It means a lot. It means a lot. This is what a championship looks like. Obviously, these guys are pumped. This championship is a long time coming. Reporting live. From the locker room in Lancaster County, Nick Volturo, CBS 21 News.